hi guys uh, today in this video tutorial i'm going to show you as to how you can use your android as a second screen to your uh, laptop or say pc or any other computer so what i have here is uh, asus uh, 3s10 uh, or the asus z500m tablet here and my laptop over there so you need a software called the mirror op sender for your pc and a mirror op receiver app for your android tablet i have given the links in the description of this video you can uh, just download it and you need to run the mirror op sender from your pc And then you need to download the mirror op uh, receiver app uh, and then install it so when you run the mirror op uh, receiver app it will give you the ip address of the uh, local uh, local ip of the uh, tablet and you need to input the ip address in the space provided here See now once you press connect, uh, this is a trial version so it will just give you a reminder. In the trial version you can use the software uh, at a stretch for say 5 minutes and then uh, it gets automatically disconnected. And you can reconnect it and use it again for another 5 more minutes. And now you can uh, see here uh, a button uh, which resembles a, something like a play icon here click on that and now uh, you can see uh, my display has got extended onto my tablet first time when you run the software uh, so now I have set my uh, tablet to tablet in the extended display mode but in uh, but in some cases when you start the uh, application for the first time it will look something like this it will look something like this uh, wherein uh, the display of your laptop is mirrored or uh, duplicated onto the tablet screen in that case what you need to do is choose windows and uh, p and uh, set it to extend and then in the mirror uh, op application go into the settings the, or something like a gear icon over here choose that go to preferences choose advanced and click extend and then ok so now uh, the display has got extended and you can use a tablet as your uh, secondary skin let me show you so so now you can see my tablet acts as the second screen so one more added advantage is that uh, you can control the audio independently you can mute the audio of your uh, laptop or a PC and allow the audio to stream to your uh, tablet. Say, let me just open a video file. Now this is playing in my PC. I can mirror it onto my. I can extend it onto my other device, and I have got a volume control over here. If I press this, my other device case gets muted, and I can control my audio here. So now the audio plays 
on the speaker so if I click on this icon here the audio is enabled on both my tablet and PC So now uh, I can have my audio controls independent as well. One more key feature of the setup is that uh, you can control uh, the windows from uh, your tablet as well. You can uh, just uh, drag and uh, drop the screen or uh, the win I mean the windows. You can control the other uh, aspects of this, uh, say the start menu and you can launch programs etc and all those stuff. So that is pretty much it guys. So that is how you can uh, use your Android tablet as a secondary screen for your uh, PC or a, a laptop say. I hope you find this uh, useful and informative. And if you feel so, please subscribe for more such videos.